not hard to notice that things are costing more than they used to. But are gas prices impacting how people are spending their 4th of July weekend? 22 News reporter Kate Wilkinson spoke to road trippers in Ludlow. While gas prices keep on rising, AAA said that they don't expect that to impact people who are traveling out on the road. And that's something that we saw firsthand. I haven't bought gas yet, but I can see it from here and it looks like it sucks. Despite not being thrilled by gas prices reaching $3.13 a gallon as the national average, Joseph Austin is on a road trip to the Cape to see his family. It's a tradition he said dates back almost 70 years. Also on the move, Eileen, Gloria and their friends heading for the Booth Bay Harbor area also despite gas prices. We're not going to let that deter us. From and there's four of us, so we all uh, have pool, a little pool our money. So, but if you're traveling by yourself, but the four yeah. of us, you know, we got the price down to a dollar a gallon. <laughs> <laughs> the Wall Street Journal attributes the rise in gas prices to a rise in crude oil prices, more people commuting and a trucker shortage. But gas prices aren't the only thing rising. The cost of food, cars and homes as well. And the Federal Reserve Chair Jay Powell is calling the current rise in prices transitory. It's something that economists are monitoring to see if this trend continues. Working for you in Ludlow, Kate Wilkinson, 20 News.